Hi friends, it's Donna, Donatella Botellino. Welcome back to my channel. I wanted to give you a sneak peek about uh, what I'm really up against with these mystery cases that I bought. Uh, this one we emptied last night. Shout out to my friend Jenea. She uh, worked with me last night until almost midnight and we were able to clear this case. So I bought a total of five and this one here was had three briefcases in it. We've gone through one briefcase. I still don't know what's in this one, but I just pulled this one out and you can see that not all of it is jewelry. Like for example, this has a butterfly in it and this has uh, some lamp finials. Here's a really pretty piece. These will go in a dibble lot that I'll do. A dibble lot is a little dibble bit, bit of this and a little dibble bit of that. So that will probably go in a dibble lot. Um, there's also looks like some picture hanging hooks and um, this beautiful um, music box. It does have some damage in it, but on it, but it's still really beautiful. And of course it's made in Italy, so I love it. Um, so this was uh, just an example of what was, oh, it looks like it has the key. Oops, right there. That's awesome. Okay, let me show you what's in the jewelry, the uh, briefcase that I br just brought into the reseller cottage. As you can see, I did open it up and I thought, holy cow, oh my goodness, so much work. Look at all that. So this is what I've been doing and this is why I didn't go live last night and I apologize for that. But I just, uh, I saw this and I thought, I just want you guys to see. I am sorting through all of these bags and bags of jewelry that I have here and trying to find only things that are good, um, in good shape and that you can list in your eBay stores, your Poshmark stores, your whatnots and all your different selling platforms. Um, look at, there's even a seashell with some flowers. It's unusual. Um, what is this? Are those bullets? Empty bullets? Or I, I don't know. Let me know down in the comments below if you know what that is. So this is um, what I've been doing. This is beautiful. I don't know what it is, but it's lovely. Looks like it opens. And... Here's a, another collection of things. Here's, it looks like, it's all glass. That's a Halloween bracelet. And a plate holder. A big bag of all beads. Um, let's see what that says. It made in Hong Kong. So. You know, pieces like this, guys, you, you may find some of these in your mystery boxes. If it says made in Hong Kong or made in Taiwan, although it's just plastic, I'm still including it because there are people that love vintage jewelry. So, um, gross. Look at that. And, yeah, things like this that are, like, stretchy. Whoops, I just broke it. <laughs> Um, no, I didn't break it. Oh, it's magnetic. Oh, I see. Oh, that's nice. That's actually a nice piece. It's magnetic. Uh, I'm going to be doing, um, oh, there's even a flosser in there. Yes, 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 folks, don't worry. I am washing my hands frequently. And what does this say? Genuine ceramic. I didn't know there was a such thing as fake ceramic. That's all right. All right, well, I'm going to take you over. Those look like silver. I'm going to take you over and show you. you get, there's even toys in here. I just don't know. There's another toy. Okay. This will go in my uh, my double lot also. And oh my goodness, I love this. This is beautiful. This is, I think, called bridal lace. It grows up north on the side of the highway. And looks like they put a piece of bridal lace in between two pieces of glass and wrapped it in brass, maybe. Um, all right, so enough sorting through this. To Ashley from Jimmy. A little Christmas ornament. All right, 
I need, oh, that's a pretty set. Look at that. That will go in somebody's jewelry box. Let me show you the jewelry boxes. So here we have it. Here's an example of some of the jewelry boxes. And that's, that is an example of one of the old necklaces that I debated putting in. Look at how cool this is with the wheat. It's like in Lucite or something. Look at, you can see how dirty my hands are from going through everything. I'm trying hard to put a combination of small things and chunky things so that you get a nice, a nice variety of stuff. So in these boxes is going to be everything from bracelets to necklaces, um, earrings, um, some chunky stuff, some not so chunky stuff. I'm trying hard to put um, a nice assortment so that the really big chunky stuff doesn't take up a lot of room. Um, this is pretty, this is hematite. You know, these bracelets that kind of, you can use them as a necklace or a bracelet. Um, there's even some new stuff. Look at this is a J. Crew 1997. Um, I know that there's some Betsy Johnson in here. I did pull out a couple of pieces of Betsy Johnson to bring to auction. Um, these are the makings of the boxes. I mean, I'm not even close to being finished. Um, but I have 20 of them started here on the table. Look at these little troll earrings. Aren't those adorable? They're so cute. So you're going to get stuff like that. This box hasn't even been started, and neither has that one. And there's this one. This is so pretty. And um, like I said, there's going to be some chunky stuff and not so chunky stuff in um, these. There's going to be some brooches. Um I want to thank everyone that's ordered. Oh, look at how unusual this is. I have, this looks like it might be, you know, homemade, but it looks like a, like a, uh, from a TV or something like a glass tube. I don't, I don't know. It's an elephant. Okay. Shout out to, uh, Marilyn Blatt. She wants to buy this site unseen and I need to reach, reach out to her and, um, give her a price on that. I also wanted to show you this here. This is filled with um, mismatched earrings. Earrings I don't have the patience to match up. If I don't find a match right away, they go into this bucket. So this whole jewelry box of mismatched earrings, as soon as I um, finish filling it, will also um, come to auction and you guys can um, match them up or use them for crafts or do whatever you want to do with them. A collection of some of the matched earrings which will go into the boxes um, at the end. I'll make sure that everybody has a nice collection of matched earrings. Some of them are so beautiful. And there's a collection of rings. I'm going to make sure that everybody has a nice collection of rings. So we're kind of putting the rings aside here. Um, this here, a magnet doesn't um, connect to it. Um, I don't know if it's heavily plated with silver or if it's actually silver. It looks like silver to me, but I'm going to see if I have time to test it. I don't know if I'll have time to test it. I did find this beautiful Brighton piece with that um, tiger's eye bracelet, which is absolutely gorgeous. And I've also put aside a collection of unusual pieces, um, things that I think are really cool that I'm going to bring as one-offs um, today. We're going to be going live on T's channel uh, tonight at 6 o'clock. Be sure, oh, this is a Waterford piece. This is so beautiful, and I think the chain is silver. So I am going to bring some one-off pieces that I, I pulled aside. You saw this in one of my previous videos. This is really um, unusual. I have no idea what it is, but it's shell, and it's so pretty. Oh, this is beautiful, too. This has got a silver chain on it. It's not marked, but I have no reason to believe that that's not silver around a beautiful piece of rose quartz. This is a barrette. I love this. This is so pretty. Okay, guys. So, um, oh, there's the lion. And I can't remember what's in here. Oh, yeah. There's that beautiful set. 
And these are actually bookmarks, which are really awesome. This is, oh, I think this is, yeah, Betsy Johnson. Here's a Betsy Johnson piece. Perfect for Easter. So we'll bring that as a one-off too. Friends, be sure. Be sure to be subscribed and be sure to join us today at six o'clock on T's channel. I'll be doing some one-offs. If you're interested in one of these beautiful uh, mystery jewelry boxes that I am working very hard to make to make sure everybody's happy, thank you and shout out to all the people that have reordered and reordered again. It only proves to me that I am my um, my efforts are. Um, paying off so they are $100 you guys that's shipped anywhere in the USA if some of you wonder how many pieces you're going to get in them it's really hard to say some people have gotten over 100 pieces it all depends on the size once the box is completely full I just close it and that is it um, so let me know you can make a comment down below if you're interested in one of these boxes and once I heart and like your comment, you can send payment to thegive11 at yahoo.com. You can reach out to me. Oh, I'm sorry, thegive11 at yahoo.com. Yes, or you can reach out to me to auctionsbydonna at yahoo.com. If you have any questions, my uh, phone number is listed down below. My All my information is listed down below. T's channel is listed down below. Be sure to hit the bell notification, and uh, that's it. I think that's it. Oh, you must be registered, please. I need your shipping information. The registration is listed down below, and that's it, guys. I'm going to keep building on these until it's time to go live this evening, and I'm trying. I'm going to try and get a little bit more shipping done. But right now, my my main concern is to get through all of these bins and get them off the reseller porch. And we will see you live. Thumbs up, everyone. Thank you so much. Welcome back to my channel. I am an estate buyer catering to resellers and collectors. My name is Donatella Badalino. My friends call me Donna. I was born on the beautiful island of Sicily, raised in Boston, and now I live in the beautiful Palm Beaches of Florida, where some of the wealthiest people in the world live. I buy entire states and truckloads of items for so you. we just bought everything so <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Doll can go home. Are you happy? We're very happy. Okay, thank you so much. Thank so this you. stuff is all great. We're gonna load it up and take it back to the reseller cottage. Let's go back to the reseller cottage, pull up a chair, and let's see what I've got for you next coming from the beautiful Palm Beaches. Oh my gosh, I found me at the fair. <laughs> It, it's me. I love it. She's beautiful. <laughs> awesome. I'm so happy. <laughs> Please be sure to hit the like button, subscribe, and we will see you live.